I look good. Skip to my Lou, my darling. Hi guys, it's Lou. Welcome to another video that I have begun to call Because Instagram. You see a lot of crazy and wonderful things on Instagram. Some of them don't really make sense. So of course I say to myself, I've got to try that. Why? Because Instagram. So today is something I've been seeing a lot of lately. It is an eyebrow trend that makes about as much sense as those feather brows we saw a couple of months ago. Only this time, we are creating waves out of our eyebrows. I've seen them called wavy brows, curvy brows, and squiggly brows. When I first saw this, I didn't expect to see so much of it. But now in my Instagram feed, I'm seeing pictures of these curvy brows everywhere. So I'm gonna do it. My face is primed to try out these brows today. I have very light eyebrows and not only that, I didn't hesitate to put concealer over my brows. Now I didn't know what to draw these wavy brows in with. Normally when I do my eyebrows, I use a brow wax and then brow powder over that. But I figured with the squiggly line, I would start with my brow tattoo pen. It's by Kat Von D and what it's normally for is to draw little hairs into your eyebrows to trick people into thinking that you have more eyebrows than you really do, which I mean, who doesn't do that? And I've also seen on Instagram the drawing of these wavy brows where there is a line on top and a line on the bottom and the eyebrow is just filled in. Well, of course, I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna draw a wavy line and build on that. So here we go. Now I've seen a lot of these brows overextended onto the temple, which I get because you want to get as many waves as you can in there. And I've got a couple going on right here. I'll just show you what I'm starting with. So now that I have that marker like wave going on on my eyebrow, it looks very unnatural because after all, what we're going for here is very natural. I'm going to build on it with some brow powder and get a more eyebrow looking wavy brow. All right, so the brow powder made it a little bit thicker and it just totally looks like I woke up this way. Mm -hmm. So I've decided not to put a wavy brow on the other side. I'm going to just do my eyebrows like I would every day and you can decide which one you like better. I'm pretty sure I know which one I'm gonna like better. Okay, done. How boring this one looks compared to this one. You guys, if my face were Disneyland, this would be the teacup ride, and this would be Space Mountain. Looking at this in the mirror, I do feel like the wavy brow pushes my eyelid down a little bit. It makes it look a little bit puffier, and my eye look a little bit less open, which is the last thing that a girl wants to do with her eyes. But of course, this trend is not made for that. It is made to just have some fun on your face and post it on the internet. Now, here's a question. Would I leave the house with my brows looking like this? The answer is no, I wouldn't. People think I'm weird enough as it is. Do I think it's fun? Yeah, sure. It was fun putting it on and it will be fun to take it off. All in all, I think that it is just a fun, trendy thing to do with your eyebrows and to just sort of create something new. See, it's new, all new. I'm gonna stick to the boring brows, but who knows, the next brow trend on Instagram I just do it. Why? Because Instagram. So that's it, you guys. That is it on this trying out the wavy brow video. If you did enjoy the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you aren't already subscribed but would like to be, please hit that button down below and you will see me very soon. Thanks for watching, you guys. Bye.